news is brought to you by the National Bank of the Virgin Islands. Cyril B. Romney Tertola Pier Park, NV Salon Spa, Nail and Barber Shops, HOV Medical and Digicel. Sign up for Digicel Plus Home Light Bundles, faster internet movies and sports. The Caribbean Baking Awards has recorded a number of firsts during the very first staging of its awards showcase, among them the Lifetime Achievement Award. Tonight's recipient is Chef McGarvey Thompson. An honor bestowed on a Chef Thompson that took him by surprise. You know there is no Mac without Arlene. <laughs> Mr. Thompson, or Chef Mac as he is popularly called, is no stranger to the culinary industry, having been a member of several international award-winning national teams for the British Virgin Islands for several years. I have to say thanks to uh, the organizer, uh, Craig and his wife. And, you know, ever since I met Craig wife, she has always been determined in going higher in her uh, her career she always she was one girl that i really admire with that determination whatever she set out to do she tried her best to and when she told me about this thing that is coming up i just said girl you're amazing you know and look at this i mean this is just the first leg and i know next year gonna be even bigger so Special awards of appreciation were also bestowed on Premier and Minister of Finance, Dr. The Honorable Natalia D. Wheatley. He was absent and represented by Junior Minister for Tourism, Honorable Luz Hodge Smith, also receiving award. Local entrepreneur, Ms. Ronit Richardson. So I want to present this award to Honorable Dr. Natalia Wheatley and just say a heartful thank you because if it wasn't for him sponsoring me at the HLSCC Culinary Baking Program, I would not be where I am today in my baking career. It certainly is a pleasure for me to be here and support uh, Shonda and Craig, and also to accept this award on behalf of Honorable Premier, Dr. Natalia Wheatley. He would love to be here. He has been very supportive of this very couple, and um, we're very proud of Shonda and Craig for putting on this event. The reason why I am giving this award to Ms. Richardson, when I started my baking, home baking program privately since the lockdown of COVID, it was my first time I was doing fondant. I did my, if you guys remember the video, I did my husband cake. He loves popcorn. So I, I tried to make this popcorn bag with real popcorn inside of it, using, of course, my inspirational um, baker hair recipe, Miss Yolanda Gamp. Um, I'm always following her and her recipe, so her recipe was the one that I used for my husband. And the fondant was just all over the place because, one, I didn't know that it needed to be in a cool place because, like I said, it was my first time. So I didn't have an AC in the kitchen. I didn't know how to apply fondant and everything, so everything was bumpy just like the popcorn that was on it. But it came out good because it looked like it had popcorn inside of the bag. And the next day, I got a, a, a message from Miss um, Richardson, and she said, you know, um, I saw your video, and this is what you should do at this time. This time, do this. And then and she's always been encouraging me and telling me, you know, um, Trying this way and trying this way. It's not every baker would give you, you know, tips, especially if she, them themselves is a baker and they have to be able to secure their skills, you know, and not share it with everybody. Those awards needed no vote, but on the voting side of things, there was only one Virgin Island company to have won an award that night. And the winner of the Best Bake Shop of the Year goes to... LSL Bake Shop. Virgin Gorda BBI. We would like to dedicate this award to the lady who has started this legacy some 35 years ago, our matriarch, Mrs. Serene Maduro. That's the S in LSL, Leslie Serene Lestine. She has been sick since 2021, so we have tried to continue her legacy. This one is for you, Mommy. 
The award ceremony was held on February 17 here in the Virgin Islands, bringing together in excess of 50 bakers and supporters from across the Caribbean region and the further fields. With this JTV News update, Kathy Richards. We know that where you choose to bank matters, and it is your vote on what your funds do in strengthening our community. As your official bank of paradise, we invest and support the lifeblood of our economy by helping in the realization of personal goals for homeownership, education, and entrepreneurial visions which support small businesses. We make it our place to connect with persons and worthy causes, and we have been doing so for more than 30 years. Where your money goes and what your dollars empower are your choice. And we thank you for choosing us, a bank that gives where it matters the most, for you, for our community, and a happier tomorrow. The National Bank of the Virgin Islands.